And hello, 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 and welcome back to some more Victoria 2 Finnish Mega Campaign Fan. Now, um, uh, what was I doing? Oh, that's right, there's rebels and stuff being really annoying and whatnot. Um, where are they? General... They're all around... Oh, there's some in Africa. Okay, that's kind of annoying, but I should be able to deal with them without any issues. Bloody Finnish communist. Um... That's alright, I can deal with them later. Um, what are these? Is that the Finnish Grand Army? Yeah, it is, it is, it is. Losing a lot of money, though. Am I going to have to put troops on ships? I think I'm going to have to put some on ships. I won't need many to deal with these rebels in Africa. Should deal with them pretty quick, actually. Now, if I'm going to go to War of America, I need to have the forces available. I need to hit them very fast and very hard and very quick as well. Uh, better on pause. 2,000? Jeez, that, that's biked up pretty high there. Are they at war again? Nope. I didn't wait till they're at war. Because they'll probably get a war with California again, I reckon. There's a good chance of that. Do 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 do. I want my old provinces back. Jerks took them from me. Oh, they won that battle over here in Dokon. Wherever Dokon is, I'm not sure exactly where that is. They're about to attack these guys over here. No, go here instead. Better choice. Once you're done, go over there and deal with them. Ah, research points has gone up. Good. Um, let me think. Do I go navy again, or do I go commerce? Joint stock companies. That that could be a good thing to get. I uh, might increase the speed of the game a little bit as well. They won the battle at the Kateringberg. Expected them to. These guys are still trying to get over here to Africa. The Kong's still going as well. It's still there. I'm still kicking. Should be able to deal with them pretty easily, I'd suspect. Who's Mali allied with? No one. Hmm, not sure how many troops those guys have, but that might be a potential uh, place I can attack them to. I think they're dealing with communists as well. Okay, they've been dealt with. They're moving over there, they are. Good. Okay, if I go to war with these guys, this is going to be really tricky. The Boston Artillery. Attack! Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take all these soldiers and send them over here. I dealt with all the rebels pretty much. I think I have, so I might even... My tax efficiency just went up as well, so I might reduce this by about half. Um, how many re potential rebels? Uh, not a massive amount. I just attack these guys. I need a lot of troops. I need the support of Mexico and France as well. They might even attack Mexico. I wouldn't be surprised. They might attack me. Oh, what's going on here? International crisis. Who am I going to back, I wonder? I'm always going to back the Ming Dynasty, obviously. Wouldn't be smart unless I did so. I'm going to build a fortress there and expand the railroad. Same thing there. There. Might as well spend the money on something. 
Kansas City as well. Let's build fortresses everywhere, I suppose. The harder it is for them to punch through it, the better. Yep, build that as well. I'm going to send these chaps back to here because we're going to have to go pick up more troops. We're going to have to build more still. If you want to go to war, then go to war successfully. Got to really get a lot of troops there. Yeah, send these back over here. Military, military, going to build more troops in North America again. That is the preference at the moment, because it saves me. Nope. What I'm going to do regardless is, I'm going to build some, I'm going to build a bit of a guard's arm to send over there, I think. Borodino, Moscow. Yeah. Wait a second, I already built two lot of Borodino. Wait a second, what I might even do is, I might build some Central Asian troops instead. Just send them over there. Because there's a fair few troops I can build for that. And what I want to do is, I want to give him one or two engineers as well. As well as artillery. Um, as well as some hussars. Don't need many of them though. Actually, no, I'll build a, build a few. And that's going to be my new troops getting built. Sent over here as well. It's a little bit getting, getting tanks though. That'll take a while to build, though. It'd be cheap either. Um, what what factories are currently not having a fun time? The canned food in that place. They're currently building some more places, though. Not that many people are unemployed. Everyone's pretty employed at the moment. It's because I'm subsidizing everything, I think. Among other things. And a lot of the factories are running pretty well, also. Great Britain still doesn't like me either. I might try and improve relations with them. I think. Send these soldiers back over here. Oh, good. Seem to be getting a fair bit of this stuff done at the moment. Uh, do I want to avoid Karl's marks? Scientific management. That could be very valuable to get, so I'm definitely going to get that. That just seems like a smart thing to research as well. These fresh troops are though. They are. Okay, send them over here then. Starting to get a build up of good sized soldiers as well. 77 regiments over there. No, go to Asheville. It's good defensive ground. Where's the ninth army current? Oh, can you not? <laughs> Why do you go for the same province? Stop making things difficult. You just have to re rebuild them. Are you serious? They're cocking attrition there. Oh, that's really annoying. Um, go here then, I guess. They're copying bad attrition, actually. Hmm, that's not good. The 
doesn't have a specific name. Does it really need one? I don't know. Siberian, first Siberian force. Where is it? Come here. Ah, spelled all wrong. First Sib Siberian force. Okay, it's named. What about the fifth army? Okay, S S backspace that. Second North American army. Good. Okay, they're mostly named, aren't they? That's good. Are they, are they going to war, are they? Oh, no, they're allied with Andalusia. Damn it! I'm not supposed to get an alliance with Andalusia. That threatens me from the south. Are they currently at war, though? They're currently at war with Arabia. Yes, yeah, a place in the sun. Yes, we're pretty fantastic, I know. Oh, there they are. Um, send them over here then. How are those soldiers building anyway? Very slowly by the looks of things. They're struggling to get small arms in. Oh, well, they'll get built when they get built, I guess. I might even have to chuck the budget. Why is that down so much? Oops. Yeah, so you can have military access. So I used to. Oh, I still got an alliance with them. So I can threaten them from that angle anyway. Kind of hope they get rolled at the moment. Which I think is essentially what's happening. They're going to start actually building up the troops now. Yep, they certainly are. They're going to be coming from mostly from Central Asia as well, I believe. They're fighting the French. What is that war over? American liberation of California. France is leading the war. Yes, might be my chance to attack as well. I'm going to have to wait for the extra forces though, can't really move until then. Come on Ming Dynasty, give me an alliance. Uh, they still don't give me one. Uh, if I had them as my ally, that would be awesome. The thing is, if Empire of Mexico attacked from that angle, no, I definitely will not give you access. That's for sure. Mexico attacked from that angle. We could hit them from two sides. They still have a lot of troops, though. Like, a lot of troops. More than you'd think they'd be able to raise. Scientific management's nearly done. These guys are gradually building up. Always help feed, feed the poor. Make the poor happy. See, even then, I've got like 48 plus 48 plus 50. So that's like 150 regiments. But even then, they've got like a crap ton of troops. But then again, Mexico's got quite a few troops as well, so maybe it would be enough. I can need at least one more large size army over there. I don't think I can really do it until then. 
Might even send the Finnish Russian army over there as well, I reckon. Some guards troops could make things very interesting. I know the railroads suck in this part of the world, but just deal with it. Everyone else does. Actually, how bad are they? There is no railroad there. Hmm, yeah. That's uh, not great. <laughs> Didn't even realize that. Don't know why they haven't expanded all the railroads around here. Seems like a logical thing to do. Really underdone. They really need forts over there in a lot of the places because not going to war the hot the high Z anytime soon. Didn't actually realise the railroad situation was that bad. Thought my capitalists were getting all that settled. No railroad in Samara. Ugh. Camp on. What's going on here? I suppose it's got that much land to cover. It's kind of difficult to get it all done, I guess. Um. Okay, yeah, i got to stop pressing pause all the time. Some of them are getting done, though, at least. Okay. Back to it. That's a lot of railroads. <laughs> That's a lot of railroads. Um, yeah, do that as well. Yeah, I need that artillery, that's for sure. Bring them together. And what I'm hoping is, is that I'll get the support of Mexico, and then we attack from two sides and absolutely crush them. That is the hope. Whether that will actually happen is a different story. That's a lot of troops. Ooh, 82 regiments. Probably get over like a mean in income as well. If I get the support of Mexico, I reckon, I reckon I'll have them. Ah, oh, more of them have been built. Good. Yes, of course we will attend. Be weird if I didn't. We will attend, and it will be a fantastic affair for all. The Olympic Games! Ooh, factory cost has just gone down. Sweet. They seem to be building more factories now, though, so that's a good thing. Yeah, yeah, keep sending them over. There's no railroad there. Oh, wait a second. Isn't that like the Trippet Marshes or whatever it's called? That would actually make sense that there was no railroad there. Tax efficiency just went up. Q. Expand the fort. No, help them out. Always help them out, of course. Who are we fighting? Seriously, like, who are we fighting? Apart from Mauritania. Just Mauritania? Yeah, I can assist. 
I don't know if I can really send any forces over there to help. Help, because it does. No, I need to put them on ships, I think. It's still a war of Arabia, and it was serious. Okay, well, they're doing that. I don't know why the French just don't try to send more troops over to America. That would be the logical choice. If I was to go to war with them, two of my allies would actually jump in. France wouldn't, because they're already at war. Wait a second, I thought I had an alliance with Mexico. Uh, what's going on here? I thought I had an alliance with Mexico. Why did I just lose my alliance? No idea what's going on there. I had an alliance with them. If they change. Oh, they might have changed government type or something like that. Yeah, so I'll assist. Now the crisis is already done, okay. I won't assist then. Well, what I want to do is I want to go to war, but hit them that hard, that quick, with the support of Mexico. So hopefully. I can exploit that. Yep, send them over. Something about some major discovery, kill bands, something about clipper transports. Empire of Mexico is very likely. Like, they'll probably jump in. Once again, I need more troops though. Like, bring it down even more. I just really want to get all the military stuff, like. I really want revenge, and I want some of my old territory back. 83 reg- they just pull a lot of regiments out, like, a lot of regiments. Hmm, this could be interesting. Army risk management, researching fairly quickly. Spurs. I didn't really want to. Oh, sorry, I ended up leading the war, did I? Huh, okay, I didn't even realize. I reckon we should have enough troops of Mexico support. Yeah, I, I reckon we will. I hope we will. Ming Dynasty still ain't giving me an alliance. Not sure what the reason behind that is. Good lines to get, bro. What about Japan? What's the odds of me getting lines with Japan? Lines of Japan could be interesting. But I don't think they're going to give it to me. Okay, we'll go send them down. Oh, damn it, I can't really deal with them. Because I do not have access. Uh, that, that's better, right? Who are we at war with now? We at war with Italy. Who are they allied with? Middle Francia. No, I have to decline that because that's just a stupid war to drag me into to begin with. Against bloody middle Frank here. What are you, drunk? Oh, just a little, mate. Mm. 
Yep, send them there. I'm gonna send these guys here as well. I just really want to get lots of troops. If I'm gonna if I'm gonna attack them, I'm gonna need overwhelming force. Nothing less, nothing more. But look at this, like 35, 16, 62, 49, 42, 30, 30, 24. Like they got a lot of troops. I mean like a lot of troops. The Mexicans do have a lot of troops as well. With my troops added to theirs, it could make things interesting. I don't like them anyway. More troops to send over to, for the fighting. Uh, do, do, do. There's encouraging soldiers everywhere. Making lots of money there, though. It's pretty kill. Combine them together. The fascists are gradually gaining more power as well. Conservatives are just holding on to power. The liberals aren't far away though. Uh, Mexico is dealing with rebels. Okay, so if we attack them, we've got to have overwhelming strength. And Mexico has got to jump in. No ifs or buts, they just have to. Because if they jump in, I might even encourage some soldiers there. Encourage some soldiers into Taria. Well, let me think. Encourage soldiers in Finnish Gotland. Finnish Gotland. Hope I'm pronouncing that right. And in finish perm. No research success, I need some new stuff. Here yeah, research that is ocean, take too long to research. Just waiting for the ships to get there. Yeah, I, I I reckon I can take them. It's gonna be tr it's gonna be difficult. Don't get me wrong. It's gonna be very difficult. No, no, not a chance. They're allied with me, so they can hopefully send troops in as well. Just don't accept one. Still communism. Yep, send them back over. So I've got a fair, fair few troops over there actually now. With the support of Mexico, I reckon I can take them. Because Mexico will call up all their reserves as well. And they would have lost a fair bit of manpower in this war, I'd imagine. Is there some alliance of Middle Frank here? I do. Go on, Lithuania, give us an alliance. No, they won't. Give me jerks. Okay, radio, man. Radio, mate. Anyway, that'll probably do for the moment, though. I hope you all enjoyed yourselves. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe. And if you've got any advice as to how I can tackle the Kingdom of America here, Please let me know, as always. Bye-bye.